Hi, Jeff. Great to see you this morning at the Wilderness Club. Shame about the weather. I uh, just want to recap on some bits we worked on. Really, really impressed with uh, the work you've put in since the last lesson. It looks completely different. Club face is now rotating open or square. Top of the backswing is completely different. Left arm's across chest. Left arm and club forms one line. And club face is um, perfectly square at 45 degrees. So you've done a terrific job there. Also, come and get the club to drop down in the slot, almost cutting through the right forearm there, just a slightly above it, but really good. If you look at Matt Every here, the same sort of swing as yours. You can see there his club face a little bit closed, but only a tiny bit. Great to the top there, quite short swing. Left arm across his chest, left arm and club forms are uh, one line, similar to you. And you can see there as he starts to unwind, very, very similar there as well to you there, just slightly above the forearm. That shaft plane so you and him look very much the same there the difference is is if we look at you as you start to unwind a little bit blurry because of the light but we can definitely see here the club face is coming just a tad open for me and when you not quite releasing the club so we can see up to this top bit as i unwind here that for me the toe of the club is pretty much toe up if we look at him here on the right we'll see it keep an eye on this club face for me you'll see that it's really starting to rotate closed. So we can see here as he makes contact with the ball, and then we'll be able to see that it wraps over. So now his club face is pointing this direction, left. Or if we go back to yours, to me, the club face is still pointing down the target line. So he's going to hit that lovely little draw that I wanted you to get. And we can see as it just starts to come out of the picture, he's at like a 45 degree angle, his club face and look at that there he's now pointing this way his club face where if we look at yours again to me it's pointing sort of that way so that was the first thing we worked on was getting him hands to work jeff and we just made tiny little back swings halfway back and just really release that right hand over the left or toe over the goal over the heel of the golf club so you're starting to incorporate that sort of right to left spin on the ball for me obviously every single shot from there was going straight left with a draw which was good and the last thing we did was we remember we put that alignment stick in line with the golf ball on the ground sort of here and now i want you to get the feeling that you start the ball right of it and bring it back just like you would do if you was taking a free kick so if we look at him here i'm just going to draw a goal there and if we're taking a free kick here and this was the wall we'd obviously want to start the football right at the wall to swing it back into the top left hand corner and that's the same as the golf swing so just get that club going down the right hand side release the club and you're starting to get to the ball right at that stick for me in the drawing i make a big difference jeff and really help that follow through if we look at that follow through we can see how high and sort of disconnected it is where if we look at mats here on the uh, on the right you'll see it's a much more rounded follow through where the club is rotating uh looks into a much more balanced finish jeff really good progress is great let me know you get on and i'll